This sold-out crowd is on its feet tonight here in St. Louis, Missouri. These fans are so excited, I'm having a hard time staying in my own seat myself. I'm with you on that, partner. We've got a great show here tonight for these St. Louis fans, and I can't wait to get started. It's so great seeing these superstars in competition here tonight. I had a feeling they are going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like... And here's the One, cover! Two. <laughs> when you talk about a man who's done it all in this business, you don't have to look any further than the heartbreak kid, Shawn Michaels. Look at that. Pandering to the crowd. Nothing wrong with keeping the pain cuz there's the cover. One, two. This has been a I don't know. He's putting a lot of the line going up there. You take one look at Bret Hart, and it's not hard to see why he's a WWE Hall of Famer. I'll put it this way, partner. If Bret Hart doesn't deserve to be in the Hall of Fame, nobody does. Here it is. He's building up ahead of steam, and he's about to let his opponent have it. And if his opponent is smart, he'll get the hell out of there. I've been looking forward to this match. This superstar is all fired up, and so is this capacity crowd. <clears throat> yeah, <clears throat> well, one mistake, and we're going to see that fire put out. All right, time to see what we got under the ring. Man, what a chair shot. Reminds me of my good old days as the hardcore champion. If that's your idea of good old days, I'm glad I wasn't around for them. <clears throat> Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. You know, if you let me train you, you could be cruiserweight champ inside a year. Oh, no. I've heard stories about the way you train people. You make Marines' real instructors look like pushovers. Are you surprised? They're just training people to go to war. I train them to be WWE superstars. Well, thanks, but no thanks, partner. I think I'll stick to announcing for now. He's tuning up. And there he goes! Sweet chin music! Rope break. He wasted no time going for that pin. This, he's got this crowd solidly behind him. And now he's going to give them exactly what they want. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. Come on, what show... He could pin his opponent One, right here. Two. Michael sure is getting up there. If he sticks around too much longer, HBK's going to stand for the has-been kid. I don't think Shawn Michaels is ever going to be a has-been. He looks as good today as he ever did, and I don't think it's going to change anytime soon. Looks like someone's moving up in the world. You gotta watch out for your opponent. He's going for the pin. One, this could be two, it. Three. The adrenaline is pumping. The crowd is coming alive. This is what they came to see. Hey, tra I've seen matches won and lost because of moves like this. This could be three One, right here. Two. I certainly you know there's such a thing as playing to the crowd too much, and that's what I'm seeing here. His opponent is out of it. He's tuning up the band. Sweet chin music. That's guaranteed to take the fight right out of you. <laughs> He's three seconds One, away from victory. Two.
When I first heard about this match, I wasn't sure what to think, but these superstars are blowing me away. This is stupid. Why is he risking everything by going out there? There's the pin! One, Can his opponent two. kick out? Man, this crowd is really swelling this guy's head. There's no doubt that these... I think he's gonna fly! Instead of pandering to the fans, you should... And there's the pin! One, two... Ugh. Bret Hart calls himself excellence of execution, and it's not hard to see why. From anyone else, that would be just ego. From the hitman, it's the truth. And that's why Bret Hart is one of WWE's most respected Hall of Famers. <laughs> Look at these superstars go. It's obvious that they never homework on each other. That's for sure. This match might have been over by now if they had. 90% of a match is in the preparation. You gotta come in ready for battle. These superstars are at the top of their game, but only one of them is gonna have his hand raised at the end of this one. And that's a real shame because like you said, this has been a great match so far. So what? You want to say that everybody wins so that nobody gets their feelings hurt? I never said that. I'm just saying that in a great match like this, everyone involved deserves credit for it. There it is. Blood in the water. The end is near. How can you sound so excited? These are human beings in the ring, for God's sake. Correction. These are WWE superstars, and sometimes this is what it takes to win. This capacity crowd is certainly getting its money's worth here tonight. And it's a good thing, too. If we're not buying tickets, we're not getting paychecks. Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about selling tickets the next time we come back here. Not after a match like this. He's going for the One, pin. Two. Yeah, that's just great. Why don't you just quit showing off and get down to business? He is getting down to business. He's in the sports entertainment business, isn't he? Man, you just can't put anything over on these fans. You sure can. not They see everything, and they'll let you know about it. Red Hart calls himself the best there is, the best there was. A high-risk maneuver in the works from that top turnbuckle. On the mat, One, shoulders down. Two. This could be it. He's got him covered. One, two. Night after night, the WWE superstars never fail to amaze the fans. And that's a good thing. I don't even like to think about where we'd be if they didn't. Well, we wouldn't be sitting here calling this match. Break. That's for sure. You got to be careful when you're going up there. <laughs> Seeing a match like this makes me proud to be part of this company. I'm with you, partner. You just can't experience a thrill like this anywhere else and that's because you're not going to see athletes like the wwe superstars anywhere else cole you certainly aren't they're the greatest athletes in the world and this is the only place you'll see them doing what they do best man i don't want this match to end i'm with you partner but it's got to end sooner or later. Well, whichever way it goes, no one can say that these superstars didn't give it everything. There's the cover. One. Can he do it? Two. Three. Even if you wind up winning a match like this, you're going to be feeling it. 
for the next week. Yes, but that's the case if you lose as well. And having to deal with emotional as well as physical pain is that much worse. Hey, that's pretty insightful for a guy who's never wrestled a match in his life. Well, I've been in the locker room after a match and seen the superstars who don't get their hands raised. You can literally feel the... He's climbing the turnbuckle. Will this pay off? He could get the One, pin right here. Two. These superstars have proven time and again that they're willing and able to go the distance. Well, you don't get too far in this business if you're not. That's for sure, partner. There's always someone right behind you, ready to overtake you if you can't keep up. This is a big risk. Will it pay off? His oh, opponent might not have enough left to kick out. The Hart family is a legendary name in the sports entertainment business, and Bret Hart is a legend among legends. And these fans are getting a real treat watching the Hitman in action. They're not the only ones I can watch Bret Hart every night of the week. One, two, three. This match proves without a doubt why SmackDown's the dominant brand in sports entertainment. I can't help but agree, partner. You won't see action like this on Raw. Even if you did, you'd have to hear about puppies and government mules and scalded dogs. It's like a zoo over there. I think we might be looking at the future of the WWE in this ring tonight. Wouldn't surprise me one bit. This is a great match and the fans are definitely into it. And that's what really matters. If the WWE fans aren't happy, they'll let you know it. Anyone who thinks this business is a piece of cake should get into the ring with these superstars. I don't think anyone would last. I don't know if this is such a good move. This could be disastrous. These fans have got something they want to share with us. That's their right. They paid for their tickets after all. We've seen some pretty good back and forth here, but you don't see too many matches. Look out. They're headed into the crowd. These superstars will take this fight anywhere. I've got to admit it. I'm impressed by these superstars' performance here tonight. We were expecting a solid match from these superstars, but this is even better than I'd hoped. Man, this one's turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I got to admit, it took me by surprise, and that doesn't happen often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty... Oh, boy. Now they're taking it into the crowd. Yeah, something tells me this is going to get ugly. I think these superstars are going to keep it up until they've got literally nothing left to give. And that's the attitude you have to take to win. You know that your opponent isn't going to hold anything back, and you can't afford to either. I'd love to know where you're coming up with this stuff, because it sure ain't from personal experience. There isn't an ounce of quit in these superstars. There certainly isn't. They're in this one to the bitter end. There's been a lot. Talk about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, but you got to worry more about the injury and less about the insult till the match is over. These superstars give every... Into the crowd they go. I can't believe it. 
You better believe it. These superstars are nuts. Oh, man. I don't envy that referee. The last place I'd want to be is between these two superstars. You say that again. Talk about hazardous to your health. Man, what a match. Kids, if you're watching this, don't try this stuff at home. Absolutely not. These are trained WWE superstars, and even they wind up seriously injured sometimes. That's for sure. Even me, a former WWE champion, has had his share of injuries over the years. The refs got a tough job trying to keep these superstars on the up and up. Anything can happen in WWE. An entire match can turn on one or two big moves. Look, if you're going to get on your high horse again and give us another lecture about playing fair, I am going to regurgitate. Is it so wrong to ask a superstar to play by the rules? That doesn't seem to be so unreasonable to me. That's because you never competed in a match. If you did, you would know that you got to do whatever it takes to win. I hope this isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. I don't say this too often, but I completely... He's going for the break. pin! Boy, this is not the way I thought this match was going to go at all. He just stole his opponent's signature move. That takes guts. Rope break. He's super. He's going for the cover. One, two, three. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. That's the law of the jungle. An injured. He's going up, and what goes up must come down. Here's the bend. This could One, be it. Two. You can imagine the tension between the competitors right now. Well, you could if you had ever actually been in a match. I don't think you need in-ring experience to feel the tenacity radiating off of these superstars. Trust me, when it comes down to you or them, it's I think someone's been taking flying lessons. Oh, man, these WWE fans are five. He may get the three count right One, here. Two. <clears throat> I cannot remember the last time I've seen a crowd this pumped up. I know what you mean, partner. These superstars have really brought the fans to life here tonight. Here's the pin. One, two. The key to winning a match like this is to build momentum. You're not going to see a match. That takes some serious skill to execute your opponent's signature move like that. This is one heck of a match so far. It sure is. What do you think the highlight of it has been so far? Well, that'll probably come a little later in the match when you shut your yap for a few seconds and let one, me enjoy it two. in peace. Well, excuse me for doing my job, partner. <clears throat> Sorry to have disturbed you. Wow. I almost feel bad for JR and the King. When's the last time you think that he's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle? One, two. This one's going to keep going until someone can't go anymore. And considering the conditioning of these athletes, that could be quite a while from now. I don't think anyone in this match has even considered that they might not walk out the winner. Of course not. That's the kind of attitude that gets you beat quicker than anything. And that's something I don't think people realize. The <laughs> mental conditioning of the WWE superstars is just as impressive as the physical conditioning.
What a match. I've got no idea what the superstars are going to do next. That makes two of us, partner. And I think that's one of the things that makes it so exciting. As long as these superstars have got anything left in the tank, they'll keep going at it. They certainly don't look like they're going to give anything less than 100% here tonight. <laughs> these superstars are putting on a clinic. Yeah, and not a health clinic. I don't think they'll be the same after this one. These superstars are looking for an opening here to try and gain the advantage. And patience can certainly be a virtue in a match like this. You can say that again. Waiting for your opponent to make a move or give you an opening can be just as intense as putting them through a table. And whether or not you have that kind of patience often means the difference between winning and losing a match. I think that if one of these superstars successfully executes their finishing move... I don't think you can keep going for much longer after taking that much punishment. One, Victory two, means absolutely everything to these competitors tonight. Now that's a real pearl of wisdom. You got any more? Like the superstar... This is gonna be big, one way or the other. I didn't expect these superstars to go after each other the way they have tonight. This has been a brutal match One, so far. Two. Well, it's not ballet, you know. Oh, really? I was wondering what happened to the pointy toe shoes and frilly little skirts. I'd check your closet, but I'd have to wait for you to come out first. Rope break. This sellout crowd just can't get enough of these superstars. And I'm glad to see it. A WWE match isn't just about competition, it's also about entertaining the fans. Well, if that's the case, how can I get you as an announcer? That's not exactly a great oh, entertainment value. You might be right. I think it would be extremely entertaining to listen to you try to call a match all by yourself. The crowd makes a huge difference, whether they're for you or against you. It's crazy to think that we actually get paid to do a job like this. There's thousands of people out there who would do this for free. Top rope moves can win or lose you the match. There's very little middle ground. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are seeing an incredible display of athletic ability here tonight. What do you expect? These are WWE superstars, the greatest athletes in the world. True enough, there's no off-season for them. There's no month or two off between matches. No, there isn't. They got to be here week in, week out, and they go until they can't go anymore. And they do it all for the WWE fans. Without them, none of us would even be here. When you see this level of competition, there's no doubt that SmackDown is just head and shoulders better than Raw. I couldn't agree more. Raw has some incredible superstars, no question about it, but they just can't compete with SmackDown's finest. Look, I know you're just trying to be diplomatic, but you can't seriously say that there's anyone on the Raw roster you'd want to have here on SmackDown. I'm 100% serious. Oh. Can you imagine having Triple H or Edge or John Cena here? That could take SmackDown to the next <laughs> level. This one could still go either way. It sure could. It's not over until the referee calls for the bell. Rope break. Talk about superstars who don't have an ounce of quit between them. You're looking at them right here. And that's a potentially dangerous mindset to be in. If you're too proud to realize that you're in trouble, you might wind up risking your career for a single match. Hey, you got to be there every single match and be willing to do whatever it takes. You'd know that if you actually ever step between those ropes.
I don't have to have been in a match to realize that jeopardizing my future for the sake of one match is incredibly short-sighted. You know, I'm going to replace you with somebody who actually knows what they're talking about. Maybe Carlito. He might be a little tough to understand sometimes, but at least he knows what it's like to wrestle a match. Me too, and I do agree with what they're saying. These superstars are pounding the hell out of each other. How much longer can they keep this up? I don't know, but you can bet that it's going to get a lot worse. Before. Going up that turnbuckle hurts a hell of a lot less than coming down from it. One, two. These superstars are clearly giving it their all tonight. No surprises there. When's the last time you saw a WWE superstar go halfway? I don't think I ever have. If they did, they wouldn't last long around here. This could go down the books as an instant classic. I think just this could be big, but it could backfire. I tell you, this is what WWE One, is all two. about. You're absolutely right. The greatest athletes in the world competing on the grandest stage of them all. I think I got a pretty good idea of who's going to win this one. I wouldn't be so sure. If there's one thing we've seen, it's that anything can happen here in WWE. I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective. I respect superstars who show some sportsmanship in the ring. Spoken like somebody who's never been in a match, Michael. If you're putting your body on the line in there, you got to do whatever it takes to take it yourself and pick up your win. You're talking about two different things. Self-defense is one thing, but cheating to steal a break. victory is something completely different. Rope break. Look at these superstars. They haven't even caught to play the fact that they might lose here tonight. They've sacrificed so much to get here. I don't think they could allow that thought to enter their heads. So much can go wrong from that top turnbuckle. One, two. Can you believe this match so far? I really can't. This isn't anything like what I expect. Look at this. You don't often see a superstar's own finishing move used against them like this. These superstars are on fire tonight. They sure are, and I don't think they're going to be put out anytime soon. You don't see action like this every... Now, there's a superstar with guts. These top rope moves, though, are high risk. One, two. I know I say this a lot, but it ain't ballet. What the? Th that's his opponent's finishing maneuver. Rope break. If you ever wonder just how much punishment a human being could take, I think you're going to get your answer tonight. You might be right. It doesn't look like these superstars are going to go easy on each other. That's not what they're getting paid for. And besides, their pride wouldn't let them give less than 100%. Oh, my! Someone's getting a taste of their own finishing move. It's not easy maintaining this kind of intensity week after week after week. Trust me. I don't doubt it. The WWE superstars don't get any offseason. They compete every week until they're not physically capable of continuing. So have you got any predictions about who's going to win this one? No way. I've seen you embarrass yourself with enough bad guesses that... I'm not going to risk doing the same. 
And the crowd has come alive tonight with a chant directed at the superstars in the ring. You can't let that break your focus, but that's easier said than done. I think things might quiet down a little here soon. You can find all sorts of weapons under that ring. Oh my! That's going to do some serious damage if someone doesn't stop this. Who in the right mind?